I'm Archibald Chesterfield III. I'm the method actor who plays Paul Pluter. Please like, subscribe, tell your friends. Please do do this. Please also remember, I need your help. My channel is under attack. I really depend on Patreon. Consider sponsoring Archie to keep him full time. The Google Ads revenue will be evaporating faster than methylated spirits in the sun. So please keep Archie full time. Archie would love to make videos for you. Okay, paid reviews. This is Alfonso. Alfonso's a bit stingy. He only sent five bucks, but... Hey, I'll make a vid. I'm desperate. Google's a fucking... Okay, he goes, Archie, how do you decide which watch to wear in your rotation? Is it random? What you're, what you're in the mood for that day? Do you change throughout the day? Do you change every day? Etc. Etc. And I gotta say, Alfonso, what happens is, is that in my case, I have some watches which are <coughs> with me, and I have others that are in the bank safe. And uh, unfortunately, I live in the Western world, and one of the big first world problems is, is theft. There's a lot of nasty fuckers. We live in an ice-fueled madhouse. There's cunts out there who are fucking on ice, met amphetamines. They're fucking nasty cutters. Sorry, I meant to say nasty kiters. A lot of nasty kiters out there. Ah, fuck it. A lot of cunts out there would fucking... They'd, they'd steal the, the, the wind out of a, um... They'd steal the wind out of a tyre. They would, uh, take the life out of your grandma just for anything for money. Desperate, nasty cunts out there. So, unfortunately, I can't keep all my watches at home. Some cunts have put my home address all over the internet, so I need to be extra vigilant because... They'll be stolen, so I've got to be extra careful. So, uh, you know, I, I, I fucking, I just a fucking cunt act. They're just cunts everywhere, and uh, they're just nasty, vicious fuckers. They just, so, to be honest with you, it's really what watches I've taken out of the bank safe. And um, it also depends what I got in stock, because at the moment I'm wearing my Polar, which is my long-term keeper, and I'm wearing a, I've got an Amiga Speedmaster Man on the fucking moon, which is one which I've, uh, I just bought to resell. So I, yeah, I try to keep a few. <laughs> okay, how do I decide what to wear and what, 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 what? And uh, I got to tell you, normally, it depends what I'm trying to do. If I'm going out with a chick, if I'm going out on a date, and I want to impress the shit out of her, Fucking gold sub, it works every fucking time! Gold sub, it really fucking works. Let me give you the drum, fuckers. It fucking works! It's the ultimate leg opener. And uh, I gotta be honest with you. Um, gotta be honest. I've taken that to Japan. So I, I took, actually, I took my Reverso to Japan because they're a more sophisticated. So I kind of tailor the watch for where I'm going. So Japan. Very high-end, high-so sort of country. You take the Reverso. They, they appreciate a work of art. Go to Singapore with nasty materialistic fuckers. You want the gold, gaudiest, goldest fucker on, on the wrist. So, gold sub. So, depends where you're going. I was also trying to impress my Japanese heiress. So, of course, the gold sub. But uh, I'm going to Bangkok. What would I wear to Bangkok? Actually, I'll tell you the truth. Fuck it! I'm going to go gold sub! Gold sub! So it depends on where and what I'm doing. So naturally, because I no longer am married, I would um, put all my stuff in the safe and take the piece <coughs> overseas because of the fucking the new world order we live in. They're trying to tax the fuck out of every cunt who's got anything of value. You can only take one overseas, otherwise the bastards could nab you. Yada, yada, yada. It's just a cunt life. So, if 
For bangers, I'll probably take the gold sub. Fuck it. I, I just want the, the kudos. You know, the gold sub, fuckers. And uh, that's probably what I'll do. So, gold sub, fuckers. Gold sub. Gold sub. Gold sub. So, um, yeah, that's probably what I will do. Gold sub, fuckers. Gold sub. Gold sub, fuckers. Gold sub. So, um, yeah, that's what I will will do there. So, gold sub. Um, gold sub, fuckers. So, it depends what I'm doing. So, I tell you honestly, you know, if I'm wearing my brown shoes, I started off, see, I'm wearing my brown these are my brown Lloyds. These are my brown Lloyds. So I, I was actually wearing them with a, with my my Speedmaster Man on the fucking Moon, because it's Sunday. I want to be more relaxed. Then I went to pick up. I went to go test drive the Alpha, and I thought, ah, oh, fuck it. I'll put the Explorer Two on for that swanky, upper middle class look. Then you know it's kind of it depends on your mood. So <laughs> these two are a very good pieces to have. It, when I had my entire collection, I normally find I don't wear the gold sub much at all. I wear the gold sub if I want to, if I'm going out for a bit of skirt and I want to impress her fucking nuts off. Gold sub! Going to a, a uh, went to Brisbane Vintage Watches, had a watch night. Gold sub! Put those cunters in their place. Uh, if I'm going to a high-end event, you know, where it's not just a Get the fuck out of my way, you piece of fucking shit. If it's more of a high-end event, I'd wear the Reverso because it's hot horology. If I'm uh, going to look at a sports car, you'd wear a sports watch. You know, an Explorer 2 or a Speedy. Hey, it's so cool. So it depends on where I am. I often will change watches multiple times throughout the day. Yes, I will indeed do that. Uh, I love my watches. Love, absolutely love the watches. So... When I had them at home, I found that I wasn't really... The gold pieces, only when I want to really fuck someone off. The vintage also, I put them away. I don't normally wear the vintage a lot. Uh, the everyday, you know, the, gold, the, the sub or the explorer. It depends on, you know, just what my mood takes me. Um, the reverse, so I'd, I'd wear that a fair bit too. You know, sometimes, I tell you this now, you're, you're on a watch forum. You're reading, I always do research. I'm always looking at forums and blogs and, you know, speaking of blogs, go and check out bazalus.com. They were sponsors of mine until they got jacked off that I gave an exclusive to the Simon Beach channel. Wow, fuck. Anyhow, it's, uh, it's interesting. I kind of, um, you read an article and you get really caught up in the watch. You think, oh, fuck. I remember years ago reading an article on the Speedmaster. But fuck, I want one, I want one, I want one. We just wanted one again. And I might see an article on the Breguet Type 20 and go, Ah, oh, fuck, I want that again. You know, so these sort of stimuli just... I, I, I like to... Normally I like to keep my watches at home, but because I've... Uh, because I... I, uh, I don't, I'm scared of getting some cunt turn up with a shotgun and say, Give me your watches. So I... I can't really keep much valuable shit at home, and I don't want. I like to. I like to travel. I'm a free agent. I'm a free man now. Fuck it, fuck it. But I find a lot of inspiration. You read an article online, and fuck, you just go and put on the put on the speedy or put on the reverse. So whatever article you're reading, and um, yeah, that that that's hit me a lot of times. I get a lot of inspiration for that. So to answer your questions, is there a rotation? No, it's whatever the mood takes me. Obviously, if I'm trying to impress a bit of skirt, get a bit of pussy, always, always gold sub, something obnoxious and loud if I'm actually wearing it every day. The vintage I like to put away, I don't really get much enjoyment out of the vintage. A lot of the um, the more modernish, the Explorer, the Speedy, I, 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 I'll change multiple times. I just love them. I love them. And I'll put them on a bracelet, put them on NATO, put them on this, put them on that. Oh, whatever the fucking mood takes me, cutters. Whatever the mood takes me. And I love it. I love it. So no set rotation. Just whatever I fucking feel like wearing. Archie Luxury, remember to subscribe. Tell your friends and like. Like? What the fuck do I have to say? Like, subscribe, and tell your friends. Also, don't forget to sponsor me on Patreon because the Google Ads is evaporating. 
Uh, paid reviews, paid watch reviews, 20 US dollars. Go and see the description of this video here for details. And fuckers, keep me full time. I don't want a fleeking job, fookers. See you later, fook, flukers. Doesn't sound the same as fuckers, does it? Really fucks that up, doesn't it? Yeah.